and gals, I'm here today to tell you about a tag that I saw. This weekend I went to Tessa, um, her name is Mika Kitty, uh, she did a 24 hour chat and in that chat I kind of like re-met some people that I saw in Nanalu's chat and in uh, JP Metz's chat. One of them was Foreign Robot, also called Josh, and I followed him on Twitter and found out that he was going to do a blog TV show and saw his videos and I saw this one and I thought it was really cool and he had been tagged so um and he tagged like one person and he wasn't sure to tag anybody else so I'm going to do this thing. The first question. Favorite book of all time. Do you like how I use the herbal essence mousse? That would be hard. I read 30 books over the past year. I'm going to do 50 books this year, and I like a lot of them. I'm a nerd fighter, so I'm going to have to say um, Bermuda's Triangle and Looking for Alaska. Looking for Alaska, I like it. Even though it was uh, John Green's first book and it's not as noticed as Paper Towns, but I liked it because of like the content and the fact that they talk about teens having sex, which is kind of like a taboo kind of thing in some books in some places. So I'm sure it's been banned in several places, along with Bermuda's Triangle. I think I liked banned books. I don't know. I think I'm just going to do a banned book series sooner or later. But yeah, Bermuda's Triangle, I like that book because it talks about, you know, like, the different sides of relationships and friendships and stuff like that. I mean, what if two of your friends are in a relationship and it's like, I feel kind of alone, and then you read this book and you're like, oh, actually... And she kind of like reads my mind sometimes. I love Maureen Johnson. She is the funniest person I've seen. I'm not even kidding you. I read her tweets like, I don't know, like my life depends on it. Books you hated most. That would be, um, I don't know. I'm not sure. There's been books that I couldn't finish, but there weren't any that like actually like got on my nerves or like, I'm not sure. I think there was one this past year, but I forgot what it was. But definitely I could not understand Pygmy by Chuck Palahniuk. Like I enjoy his work, but that book was crazy. I didn't even understand it. I swear I am in college. I am a smart person most of the time, but I just didn't understand that book. Book I am currently reading. That would be Airhead by Meg Cabot. It's a really funny book. You should check it out. It's hilarious. Reading Guilty Pleasure. That would be Gossip Girl. I'm not even kidding you. That is my, uh, I'm not even kidding you. That is my Guilty Pleasure. Like, they're not that great of books. And as much as I try to be like, yeah, they're, they're, they're alright. Like, they're not, like, the best books ever. But I get excited and I like them. I like them. For the fifth one, I'm supposed to show you my book collection. So, yeah. Over here is my bookshelf that's supplied by the university housing that they give me. Um, up here I have, um, like, magazines and a textbook that my aunt gave me, and then some movies and CDs, and a VHS, which you probably haven't seen in a long time, and here we have a lot of books. There's Sister of the Traveling Pants, three Gossip Girl books, or four, actually. Um, Looking for Alaska, which I just really wanted to take everywhere. Um, the Spiral book is a book that we had to have for um, English 1101 and 1102. And then Bermuda's Triangle! Down here, I hope you can see this, I don't know. I have my um, like stuff that I read before bed kind of place. Um, I haven't read a lot of these in a while, like Maureen Johnson, that book right there, uh, Sweet Scarlet. Um, I read that this summer and then got a free book online when somebody was doing a um some sort of giveaway kind of thing and i won and it was awesome and then we have um vintage jesus which i really haven't started reading but it's really good it's by um mark driscoll and he has an amazing church in maybe colorado i don't remember seattle washington maybe i don't know a uh, wicked i have started i've read like half of it i think let's see how far yeah like half of it and i need to finish that and review it. And Dear John, oh my gosh, my mom read this and I love it, but I haven't finished it yet. I, if you haven't seen the, uh, if you haven't noticed, I don't finish a lot of books uh, in one sitting. Um, this is another new book that my, I gave my mom for Christmas and then, uh, she let me borrow it to read. 
So that, ladies and gentlemen, is my version of this tag. I'm going to tag Elizabeth and who else? I'm not sure. Chris. Chris Remy. You better do this. Romsify. I know you make a lot of videos, so you should do this because you're awesome. If you want to do this, do it. Do it. Because it would be awesome. And put them as a reply, a video reply to this video. And, um, if, I'm not saying if it's good, but, um, I will try to approve as many as possible and get you guys involved. Because I want to do that. Like, if you read one of the books that, um, I've reviewed, just comment on them and tell me, you know, I like this book or I didn't like this book. Why did you like this book? Um, you know, that kind of stuff. Um, anything. Like, if you want me to do a certain book review, just tell me. Like, I'm not saying I'm going to sell out or anything like that, but just, if you think I should read a book, doesn't matter how crazy it is, just ask. I mean, there's no harm in that. Alright.